The Queen's Beast. The Unicorn of Scotland. Silver Steeler here. Let's take you down by the river again for the fourth in the Queen Bee series. Delville, Indiana, White River. You are here. And here we are once again along the banks of White River, Daleville, Indiana, to showcase the fourth in the series of ten of the Queen's Beast minted by the Royal Mint. Fourth in the series, the Unicorn of Scotland. It has a coronet around its neck. It's like a collar with a gold chain attached. It is thought that the chains were to show a great beast tamed to serve the king. But as with most chains beasts, its strength is emphasized rather than diminished by its shackles. It holds the royal coat of Scotland unchanged since the time of Scottish King Alexander III. Very nice piece in this series. It's not in my top three, but I do like it a lot. This will be the last video down by the river as the sun diminished shortly after filming this one and we weren't able to do it again. And then the winds came and destroyed all the leaves on these trees. So why don't we take it to the next location? Our second location takes us once again to Mount Summit Lake. And you are here. And here we are again at Summit Lake. Beautiful lake. It's a man-made lake. But let's talk a little bit more about this coin. Um, there are tales of this mythical unicorn that date back to around 400 BC. So yeah, quite a while ago. Uh, the creature was at first thought to be huge, strong and fierce, and later a more elegant beast. A symbol of purity and innocence. James I of England, who united the English and Scottish thrones, chose the Scottish unicorn to join the Lion of England in supporting the royal arms. They have supported the shield ever since. And I've actually got a round on order that I'm getting that has that design on it. Here soon. A lot of history between the unicorn and the lion. So why don't we go to the next location? Our third and final destination is once again Cataract Falls in Cataract, Indiana. You are here. All right, everyone. Here we are once again at Cataract Falls, Indiana. And I want to clarify a little something I said earlier in the video about no more river shots. Uh, there still would be four more episodes after this to complete the eight that have been minted so far. It's just there'll be no river shots in those final four episodes. Instead, we've decided to shoot more falls. So, more bonus falls, which has been my favorite of the three locations so far. So yeah, the Unicorn of Scotland. A very nice piece. Very nice scenery here. Got some of the trees with the fall foliage. They survive down here, unlike where I'm up at. So, winter is coming that's for sure but enjoy the fall while we have it here remember to like subscribe and all those other good things i'll see you on the next video